we're going inside the biggest freezer and oven in the world. This is the McKinley Climatic Lab in Florida. It's huge. In fact, it's a monster. This is the only facility in the entire world where you can put a full-scale aircraft uh, inside of an enclosed building, take it down to any temperature or up to any temperature that you want while you operate the aircraft to full power. It's the perfect place to test the US's latest stealth joint strike fighter, the F-35B. B for beast. It's an aircraft that goes 1.6 times the speed of sound. It pulls nine times the force of gravity, and this particular model can come to a stop and hover. We need to create all the environments that it'll fly in and operate in. We can take this chamber anywhere from minus 65 to 165 Fahrenheit. So we fly with full afterburner power, and we hover the jet inside a building here. A fighter jet that's designed to fly at 1,200 miles per hour, but somehow they've bolted it to a frame to stop it taking off. It was a very surreal experience to have 34,000 pounds of thrust and 2,000 degree heat exhaust going out the back of this building and myself not going anywhere at all. It's pretty darn cold in here. <laughs> that's because today they're creating an icing cloud for the F-35B to fly through. Jets of precisely controlled water droplets as tiny as 10 microns are hurled at the plane to see how it deals with the worst kind of weather. Every fluid in any aircraft gets very, very viscous. Landing gear typically have difficulty going up and down. The fuel systems can freeze if you get too cold. Luckily though, the F-35B seems to be handling the cold nicely. It's a spectacular fighter jet. Pushed to its limits, by an amazing team of engineers. I have the power. I can create sandstorms, dust storms, or freezing rain in a different chamber all on the same day in Florida. So <laughs> we can do any weather uh, other than lightning strikes or a tornado, but would you settle for a hurricane? Bring it on. Rick Adams, The Weather Channel.